Yeah, that is black. Wow. That's about as far as I can get you. If you flush the organisms that are right on the side, it's, will it kill them if you just flush them quickly? I mean, it's probably um, quick enough that they can just sort of hold their breath. Barite, a barite that barite precipitate. And then if you, Bob, if you look down in this corner, in the lower right-hand corner of that little pool, the side pool, I think you might see the, the brine actually seeping out of that little hole in the wall down there. You can see the, the shimmering of the surface of the brine. So it's a different density of super salty water and that's what's making it compress and stay almost like this underwater lake that you're seeing. See it there on the right. Yeah, just By, how, how it's like a current. Out. You can see you the current. Just, just yeah. Thanks, Mary. Oh my gosh, look at that. Whoa, look at that. It's just mind-boggling to see ripples on the bottom of the ocean. Yes, it's yeah. like a lake. And it's just, and people keep now feverishly typing in what makes it not mix. And Our porch in there. So if you look wow. straight down a bubble camp, you'll be able to see some of the waves that we created when we first hit the brine pool. All right, you want to come down just a little bit more and make some waves? Yep, we have a lot of methane and sulfur. A lot of methane and sulfur? Yep. A lake in an ocean. Charles, how does it compare to the other brine pools we've been in so far today? So, we have wow. methane from two previous ones. Was that what you were expecting to see? Yeah. Great. Methane and sulfur. So, there's actually more methane in that one than the previous ones. Oh. One of the strangest places on the ocean's floor was only just discovered in the 1990s. And my degree is one of a handful of people to ever see it in person. Without a doubt, one of the most amazing things that I had ever seen in the bottom of the ocean, it was while filming for Blue Planet, it was in the Gulf of Mexico. And I noticed there's something out in the distance, couldn't tell exactly what, but it looked like a dark band. And as we approached it, the dark band became a donut. I saw this donut that was black in the center. What the heck is that? And so as we get closer and closer to it, I noticed that the black band had what appeared to be kind of steam over it. And then I looked and there was water lapping against the shoreline. This band was a ring of muscles. And inside the ring of muscles was a lake. And it's like, wait a minute, I'm already underwater. And we went out over the water in this lake and tried to descend it and bounced off. It was so super saline and dense that the submarine couldn't go down it. We literally bounced off. And as we bounced off, we sent ripples heading back to the shoreline. It was insane. I've never seen anything like it.